He's a terrorist sympathiser. And how can you vote for him? Him, Diane Abbott, MacDonald will just ruin the country. Have you voted Labour before? No, and I never will. Don't and believe did, don't believe Labour are the party of the people. And not the party my granddad supported, my dad supported, and Atkins support. No. Do you think Labour have abandoned towns like Darlington? I've just been in the market hall. Have you been in there? It's like a ghost town. It's disgusting. I like Darlington as a shopping town. I've come here for Christmas shopping and I've been in there. <laughs> and it's, it's like death warm up. It's like a mortuary. There's nothing there anymore. Look at the high street. There's nothing here. What can you say? I'm not liking him. I was an ex-serviceman. And I didn't like it when he's always going to these funerals abroad of the terrorists and that were fighting our soldiers. And that bugs me that, yeah. Do you think he's a threat to national security? I really do, yeah. Him in charge? God, I'll never sleep. I really won't. No. So, uh, got a floppy head. You don't know how to dress. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't make much sense. But I'm just talking about Boris, all about the power. Doesn't know what he's chatting about hour after hour. No one's going to vote for him. He's not doing well. Take it back and spin the world. Boris, I don't get on with you too well, mate. Not going to lie. There you go. Come on, and we want one for Jeremy now. Come on. Jeremy, Jeremy Corbyn. Corbyn. Come on. Jeremy Corbyn, an old fart. I could spin you around the board like I'm playing darts. 180 I'm scoring. You're only scoring 40 seats. I'll sit you back down in that seat and then you'll remember me. Yeah, there you go. Have you voted Labour before? Never. No, I'm not likely to either. I know who I'm voting for. Hopefully they'll do all the business for us. Is that for Boris? It is, yes. Yes. Why is that? Well, I mean, we voted for Brexit and it's, it's a bloody mess. And uh, he's got the plan there and I think that's going to get it quicker and quicker. Uh, whereas the other parties are going to put another year on it if, if we ever get there. I think the country's just been slowed down, it's been a bit of a mess. I've always been a constant um, Labour family, like I say, for years and years. My grandparents, my mother, everybody was always for Labour, and I always was, but not now. Not now. Big Conservative. Do you think Labour have let down Darlington? I do, 100%, yeah. Yeah, have you seen it? All the shops are closing down, everything, you know what I mean? And that was from when Labour was in. Got nothing now to what we used to have. It's not the town it used to be. Well, I think Conservatives will bring us round and do things better. Definitely. My mum's one of them wasp women, it's not fair on her. Well, she doesn't get a pension. Credit, She's worked, worked and got her, worked for a pension, now they won't give her it, and it's disgusting. You know, so Jeremy Corbyn's the one that's going to sort that out, you know, and abolish universal credit. But they should have done what the country said at the time. It shouldn't have gone on like this. Do you think Jeremy Corbyn will deliver Brexit? I honestly haven't a clue. No idea, I don't believe one of them. I've always voted Labour, so I'll probably be voting Labour in the election next week. So. Why is that? Me, well, to me, I've always just voted Labour, so it's all I've had me over the past, so... Absolutely. I've always been Labour, but no, not this time. No, I think he's spoken there before.